Hello and welcome to The Works, I'm Ben Che. Regular viewers of The Works will know that saxophonist Timothy Sun is no stranger to our studios. He'll be with us again later to give us a preview of his debut solo album. Guangzhou Painted Porcelain or Guangchai is hand-painted glazed porcelain developed by Guangzhou craftsmen in the Qing Dynasty. At the time, Guangzhou was the only trading port in China open to other countries, and the porcelain, designed for overseas markets, combined elements from Eastern and Western cultures. Its production was once a major export industry, but today there are fewer than 100 masters remaining in Guangzhou and less than a handful in Hong Kong. And not many young people are interested in learning the traditional skills. Kiza 這樣想呢,就有其他的媒介可以繼續去延伸下去。Dixon Nye is also known as Lam Dun Shang Ming, a name inspired by a poem by the Song Dynasty poet Su Shi. He works with Guang Chai or Canton Porcelain. Passionate about Guang Chai since his third year of secondary school, he began studying how to paint on porcelain with Master Tam Chi Chong at Yutong China Works, serving an apprenticeship there for seven years. In 2018, he became an artist in residence in Taofeng Shan Christian Center. Tinke是 Dohongsan可本身有好多福音的詞氣,咁其實我每學習一件詞呢,亦都對基督教的故事有更加深嘅瞭解。我諗到一詞氣,佢除咗係一個氣名,再一個容量之外,其實佢都係一個聖在道理
Lam Dun Shang Ming doesn't only paint on white porcelain. He has also experimented with adapting the porcelain painting techniques to other mediums. Lamfali Hoshi 當它燒製好之後,那件物件是浪花。On show at Hannah T's gallery, the group exhibition Nothing Like the Taste of Print features 21 emerging Hong Kong printmakers who work with varied techniques that include relief printing intaglio and stencil organized in collaboration with printmaking studio marble print clay the exhibition examines the semantic aspects of the term print itself including the activity of printing and the different creative approaches and techniques adopted Welcome back. 
Timothy Sun studied saxophone and clarinet at the Guildhall School of Music and Drama. Today, he's well recognized in Hong Kong, Macau, and internationally. As a chamber musician, he has performed at the Carnegie Hall, Wigmore Hall, and the Barbican Center. He has also collaborated with dancers, choreographers, and multimedia artists. Next month, he is launching his debut solo album of 10 new songs composed by local composers and an accompanying concert. And he's here with me right now. Timothy Sun, Hong Lo, welcome to the works. Hi. Hi. So, Timothy, you've been here before, but you're back this time because you're releasing a solo album, your debut album. Yes. Uh, let's talk about that, called Sway With Me. Uh, yes. What is the idea and inspiration behind it? Uh, Sway With Me, uh, the inspiration is S. S means sun is my surname, okay. so it's my way. So it's sun way, way sway with me. That's the, the meaning of it. So this is your uh, debut solo album. Uh, what was the idea or inspiration behind releasing it? Why now? I always dream to have an album myself, but I am a Virgo, so I'm a little bit of professionalism. Uh, I have commissioned six composers uh, to write music for me. And uh, I always dream to have an album myself, to, to talk about myself, to use saxophone, uh, the voice, mm. to communicate with the audience. We have uh, Yin Ng, Ng Chak Yin, mm. and we have Perry Loud, and we have Harris Ho, and we have Joyce Zhang, and we have uh, one Macau composer called Joe Lee, Lei mm. Zhen Yat. And uh, each of them uh, were commissioned to write one or two songs? One or two songs for me. And CY Leo is my album producer. You've mentioned uh, six composers. Pong, you're one of the composers on this album. Yes. Uh, tell me about the process of working with Timothy. Uh, how did that come about? Yeah, uh, Timothy invited me quite a long time ago to write Taylor make writing a song for him. So I decided to write something rather personal because I, I've been friend with Timothy for many years, mm -hmm. I decided to write something to let him to tell his story. So one of the songs is called A Home For. It's talk about home, simply talk about home. Because he couldn't go yeah. back to Macau to visit his uh, parents uh, due to the pandemic. Um, so he, um, in homesick, so I, yeah, yeah. I, I decided to write something for him to express his emotions. Right. So the first song is called Home oh, For. Yeah. And you also have another composition as well, right? Yes, I, I uh, wrote another song called Clap Clap. So basically called Clap Clap. <laughs> <laughs> it's a very energetic, uh, vibrant song. I just want to uh, write something happy because all of us in these two years, uh, in you know, we are trapped in yeah. the pandemic. like. It's a good song for people who are in quarantine. Hmm. Yes. Very nice. And apart from Pong, how did you go about selecting the other composers to work with? Oh, they are all my good friends. Mm -hmm. uh, we, uh, some of them we have actually worked before. Uh, first, when I first tell them that I want them to uh, write me a song, I tell them that the songs should be able to singable, so later we can put lyrics inside. Very nice. Yes. Well, let's talk about the actual uh, music on the album itself. Uh, I mean, you composed two of the pieces. What kind of genres or styles can we expect from this album? I think it's a bit of everything. A classical, fusion, uh, jazz, mm, pop, pop, yeah. And is that a natural reflection of what you love as a music or yes. who you are as a musician? Yes, yes. Mm. Uh, to show that I, I am able to, I'm able to play at every different genre. Right. Yeah. Uh, and, and also, because you're a sax saxophonist, um, what other instruments are featured on the album? Uh, can you give, me, give us an idea? Uh, out, well, actually, alto saxophone and tenor saxophone. Mm. Only two saxophones. Okay. Yeah. And how about the other, uh, on the different tracks? That, will there be other instrumentalists? Um, oh, yes. Yeah, other... Yes. We have a string quartet, mm. uh, and we have a band. We have a guitar, string, uh, guitar, uh, bass, guitar. bass guitar and drums, piano wow. as well. So yeah. a real, a very wide yeah, range of yes, different styles. Yes. Well, on the actual album, there are ten tracks. Uh, tell yes. us about the recording process. How how long did it take, um, and uh, what was the process like? Wow, that's a very big question. Uh, we only have two days to record the whole album, uh, the actual band, mm. uh, and the string quartet. 
So it quite is quite intense. Um, and this was recorded in Hong Kong. It, we it recorded in Hong Kong. Yes. And where was it uh, mixed and uh, mastered and stuff? Uh, mixed in my studio, <laughs> actually. Yeah, yeah. So uh, Sway With Me comes out on August the 13th, but yes. the con there's also a release concert on August the 14th. Uh, tell us about the concert. What can people expect at the concert? Oh, the concert mm. would be include the whole album, the song that I'm going to play in the album, and also some of the pop music as well as a cover, and some of the Chinese uh, Canton pop music, and some of the old... Uh, old style um, English music song as well. Okay. Yeah. And you mentioned that there'll be surprise, there'll be surprise vocals yes, as well. Yes, we have a special guest. Yeah. And uh, after the album comes out, do you have any plans to do more shows or even tour? Hopefully. Yeah. Hopefully we can tour in Macau mm. when the borders open, and and uh, I will have a solo with the Macau Chinese Orchestra in next next season. Okay. Yeah. okay, so both of you are here today. We would love to hear a tune. Uh, what song would you like to play for us in the studio? And why have you chosen this song? We're going to play a piece called A Home For by Pong Law. Mm. And Pong has mentioned a bit about it. Uh, tell yeah. us your personal feeling about this song. Then. Uh, Pong, especially uh, Taylor made this song for me called A Home For because I, uh, I over the last two years, mm. I feel I, home, I have homesick myself and I don't feel very happy <laughs> for not being able to go back home so he especially write this piece for me okay well let's uh, let's hear the piece yes. and thank you both of you for coming in